give it up. Well, boy, he's gone for that one. It's just gone over the top of McGill's head. What about a pull shot again? He's not going to die wondering about that, that is for sure. Anything short, he's going to go for it. They tried to do this with the first delivery he faced. But that was more like it, albeit risky, taking it from so far outside off stump. At least he got the length somewhere near right. Again, he's got it through. It wasn't again. It wasn't a bad delivery from Gillespie. And he goes for four again. Although I'm seeing the humour in it, I don't think the Australian fast bowler is. Once again, a good line, good length. Batsman. This occasion was Haverbull Bashar is able to squeeze it through the gap between about third slip and the man in the gully, and that will frustrate Jason Gillespie. test match well, he's going for the variation lost control of it and a, a useful boundary for Bangladesh to complete the over and just the change up didn't work and a freebie for the batsman Yeah, we dis disappointed with that ball. He bowled a good over in that, and we saw a couple of swings from the Bangladesh boys. And yeah, you really want to get that online, and I think the off, off cutter will grip on this wicket. Into the favoured area again, behind square, through the onside. So Bangladesh proceeding very smoothly so far today, which is a, is a very good sign. A streaky boundary, exactly what McGrath was playing for. But some, some good fortune there with a solid outside edge finding the gap you'll still be encouraged by that it's made Bashar really reach for that away from his body well bowled has been replaced Brett Lee's the man and with me is Jim Maxwell enjoy that they like the short stuff and love attacking it Although that wasn't hit out of the meat. It, uh, it's rare that they let too many of these go without having a crack, as they did last night. It wasn't hit in the middle. And it probably will encourage Brett Lee to bowl there again. But to cause some trouble. Can he do it here? Cheeky single, and that's his half century. He's got home. Rudy Kurtzen thinks it's OK. The first half century for a Bangladesh batsman against Australia. And that is a, a landmark that should be applauded by everyone at the ground, not just the Bangladeshi team. A wonderful effort by Habubul Bashar. Right on the two-hour mark. Good time for that 50 as well. He's launched himself and got hold of it reasonably well. But it was not a convincing shot. Cleared the infield. He's doing it again. Oh, oh, right and bowling. Magnificent delivery from McGill. 
Well, he's kept that one in his kit bag for a while. And finally, producing a ball that the batsman had no idea about. He thought it was the leg break. It wasn't. And he's been done cold. Watch this superb delivery. Well, it wasn't bold, it was LBW because it came off the front pad. And that was not picked. He hasn't bowled too many today. We talked about him having the bat pad in. Maybe to catch an edge off a bouncing wrong and he doesn't need it if he is. Beautiful piece of bowling. Watch the deception here. He did not pick the wrong one. Did him cold. Beautifully bowled by McGill. And uh, that's the end of an, a, a superb innings, really, for Bangladesh from Bashar. But with his departure, events could move speedily. Now, this is the type of dismissal that spinners and leg spinners in particular just love bowl a thousand leg breaks 